Welcome to the course on Project Design Monitoring Evaluation. I'm Cindy Collins. I teach Project Design and Monitoring and Evaluation because I'm more of a practitioner, and this really is a, a hard skills kind of course. And, and I hope you think of it more as an apprenticeship uh, than uh, an academic exercise. Um, uh, my background in, in, in design, monitoring, evaluation is, is pretty broad. Uh, I used to do consulting work for the United Nations on a variety of projects, um, some related to humanitarian assistance, uh, many related to international development, and I got to see uh, the design and evaluation of projects from that very, very high level. Um, I also worked for, I did a lot of work for international NGOs, international non-governmental organizations. And again, I was just one of those people who just flew in, did two weeks of evaluation. I might fly in and do two weeks of needs assessments and fly back out and, and begin teaching again. Uh, I teach quantitative methods and qualitative methods as well as project design and evaluation. Um, the experience that I really, really needed to teach this as well as I could was to actually go and embed myself uh, into an indigenous NGO, that last piece um, of, of stakeholder in a project. Uh, I really wanted to experience what projects look like from the perspective of the indigenous NGOs, but even more importantly, from the perspective of the people these projects are supposed to be assisting. So I, I lived with and worked for uh, only Nigerian NGOs, um, uh, in the Niger Delta of Nigeria for about three years. And it really, really rounded out my understanding of all of the things um, that you really, you really need to know and understand to be a really good monitoring and evaluation specialist. So the way I designed this course, because I'm always thinking of jobs, <laughs> Um, I'm, I designed it around a job description for a monitoring and evaluation specialist that USAID put out. So everything that you learn through these next 15 weeks satisfies one of the, the job tasks, responsibilities, or skills that USAID would expect from a monitoring and evaluation uh, consultant or expert. The other thing I did was I structured the course along uh, the project cycle. So you're really going to get the feeling from the beginning of project cycle, where you're just doing project identification and design, you're going to get the experience of every cycle and what an ME person is actually doing in each of those pieces of the cycle, all the way through evaluation and reporting. Um, to be successful in this course, uh, I really do hope that you fully participate. Uh, not just in the asynchronous times where we ask you questions and you respond to them, but you really come prepared for our live sessions. And I also hope that you have a, uh, you keep, have a sincere interest in really gaining these hard skills because I have to tell you, the skills that you're going to learn during this course are so highly marketable in international affairs.